If your iPhone does not display the new iOS 26 update in the software update section, then you should install the pending iOS 18.7 final version of the iOS 18 update on your iPhone. So you need to install iOS 18.7 first on your iPhone and then upgrade to iOS 26 because this update provides important bug fixes and security updates and is recommended for all users. Alternatively, you can directly install iOS 26 on your iPhone, scroll down, and see the option for upgrading to iOS 26. I installed iOS 18.7 on my iPhone 16e, so I can safely install iOS 26 at any time. So you have two choices. Select any of them, both work, and don't worry about installation problems. For the iOS 26 update, you need 12 to 15 gigabytes of free space on your iPhone and keep your iPhone plugged in and charged to at least 50% during installation. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for new free tech guide video updates.